this it is like a bug when it's supposed to be here because it's a weird arm it's 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 bigger than and it looks like half the human what the heck is this What's up fellas, Ikari here with some more Assassin's Creed Origins. So anyway, we are still in Siva and it's time to move on to the next city. But before we do that, there are still a couple of side quests I want to complete. Also, by the way, I think I found a solution for this weird side ponytail Bayak has. Actually, I found this option here, you can put a hood on of the outfit. Also, this outfit looks really cool. It's uh, a bit more like an assassin actually should look like. I mean, yeah, I get it. This game is called Origins for a reason, because the assassin order has not been created yet. I guess we will witness how it begins, how it gets to be. But yeah, anyway, first things first, let's see what this side quests are about. There are still two side quests left. One is right over here. Should be over here, yes. Yeah. Necropolis. What are this here? Inspect. Animals. Using the necropolis as a den. No wonder it looks like this. You know, I think they kinda tried to adapt some things from the Witcher. Certain elements. Grandfather. I have missed you. I only wish you could have known Remu. Okay, very interesting. What exactly are we doing here? Cool. It has been too long, son. Yeah, this outfit looks uh, like a snake, actually. The hood. I think it's also comps. It's called something with. Yeah, it's called Desert Cobra. I think it's one of the DLC outfits. Pretty much, yeah. So, anyway, what is this about? This was his old hideout. Anything else I can do in here? Be like another entrance. How do we drop here? I think there's another entrance I have to go to. Somewhere over there. It's not funny. Look at this. It is dangerous here. Get on home. Bayek, you're back? Where is Chenzera? He wanted to see the skulls in the hyena den. But the hyenas came back. I ran this way. Chenzera ran over by the tomb. You are lucky the hyenas didn't chase you. Go back to the village. I will find your brother. Um... What? Do I have to tell my parents? Chenzera got you into this. He will have to talk to them. Now go ahead. Do I just imagine it? Or is his voice a bit muffled because he wears a hood? Or a face mask more like... Also, there are scorpions over there. Look at this. Really nice attention to detail in this game. Let's see what do we have here. Yeah, this is the other entrance exactly. Can I? No. Well, sometimes you can break stuff. This here. Ah, there. 
That's some kind of... Yeah, that's what I meant. Like some walls can be broken. Can I light this stuff up? Oh, okay, he does it automatically. That's really cool. Chancellor, stay there. I'm coming to get you. Violet, is that you? You've come back. What is this guy? Let's see how do we get it's like a puzzle, I guess. Some objects can be moved, like like this. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Obviously not like this, dude. Let look. I am vibing. It's 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 party. Okay. Let's let's stop this. Okay. Let's not. Uh, yeah, I have to move it over here. Obviously. Oh no, I have move. I have to move this one. Yeah. Looks like I can. Yeah. You cannot move it sideways, not strong enough. And over there there's also something. Shield. Cats. Are those really like... Mummified cats? <laughs> Looks like it. I move this? I will do nothing. Yeah, I... I no, it's not possible to move it like this. I should have pushed it to the other way, I guess. Like how the spider webs also burn from the torch. This game is look at this, it's so cool. This game has a shitload of really nice oh there's this guy. Real nice attention to Julia yeah, Jump. Gentlemen, are you alright? I can't believe you are back. You should not be in here. I'm hiding from hyenas. Benuku told me about that. It's not enough to get yourself in trouble. Now you put your little brother in danger? But it's with Femu gone. All right, I understand. Let's get you out of here. Maya, look at that. What is it? I'd like to know myself. It must be very old. Someday I'll learn to read what it says. Which way did you get in? That way. But that's where the hell is. I want to tell you, well... What is it, Chancellor? It's my fault about them. They asked where you were, and I didn't tell them. I told them. Chancellor, don't feel bad. You have no way of knowing what they would do. Anyone would have done the same thing in your place. I guess. Let's check this shield out. I still have some level seven. Yeah, this one looks pretty good. So what's with this thing? Ancient writing from the old kingdom. I guess this is it with this tomb. Now I just have to get this guy. Hey, did you just start talking a different language all of a sudden? What was it this here? <coughs> I 
Yeah, that's the exit, I guess, yeah. Oh, there they are. Start by looking out for your brother and not taking him to dangerous places. I promise. Now get back home. Okay, not bad. Side quests are really nice in this game, actually. As I said, it's uh, kind of reminds me on The Witcher. Well, Witcher 3 to be precise. The way they do certain things in this game. Anyway, there was another side quest. Let's see where it was. I should be cautious around here. Nah. No shits given. I'm just going to ride through this checkpoint or whatever it is. What? I'm just passing through. What the heck? You want to kill me for that? Well, that's a bit rude, mate. I don't like the tone of your voice, sir. Or how was it? I don't much like the tone of your voice, sir. Okay, so there is the other side quest we were looking for. Let's see, it's called Diax Promise. No, that's not it. Or is it? I think that was the right quest marker. My son. You wanted the stars. The stone circles show the gods' places in the sky. And your grandfather once told me they also show our place in the world. to find every stone circle the sphinx and the pyramids too and i'll find my place and you will have them okay very nice so, the memory of his son what exactly do we need to do here I can move this... Ah, I have to put it where it belongs. Why are there so many poor in Egypt? And those who don't belong here are rich. Okay, that's it, huh? That's cool. Yep, I get it. Fields. Assassin's feel. Okay, the new game. Okay, so I guess this is it for the side quests. I think this is... I have completed pretty much everything there is. There was this here, this last hideout. Not, uh, it's more like a treasure hunt, you could say. But the enemies were super high level there. Like, I did absolutely no damage at all. It was weird. So I guess uh, I can leave it for later. And for now let's go and continue with the main quest. Interesting. So, there's like a little... Not really interaction, yeah. A little interaction between those two guys. Like a mini cut, not really a cutscene, but yeah. I like how they put a lot of really nice attention to details, like even in some unimportant side quests. You can actually see them talk. Okay, anyway, we are going back to 
the guy, whatever his name called, to Bayek's friend and tell him that we are ready to go to Alexandria, by the way it is. It says Bayek is ready to go back there and reunite with Aya. I guess this is the girl we saw in the opening cutscene. It's love interest, probably. Let's see. Be sure you are ready before you go. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, I will be able to return. Yeah, it says you can return later, obviously. So why even ask, huh? I must leave Siwa. There are others to whom I must deliver justice. Especially the one known as the Snake. How will you find these men? Aya has been tracking them in Alexandria. I must find her. She said she would be visiting her cousin at the Great Library. Great Library? And she said that you are coming to tell you one word. Serapis. Serapis? The god that Greeks and Egyptians share. Of course, I see. And Bike, do something about that beard. <laughs> Goodbye, How can you friend. see it? How can you see it through the mask? Yeah, he should like remove it during cutscenes, you know, that, that would make more sense. But I don't want to see the ponytail. Oh shit! Layla, you need a refill on Cyclosporin. Stat! Layla! Wakey wakey! <sighs> don't make me come down there! Layla? Layla! <laughs> come on back! Layla, are you with me? Have 50. Told you not to call me that. Thing is, the fastest way to get your attention is to piss you off. I'm paying attention. Okay, you need to take a break. The animus is rejecting you. Oh, I'm fine. Yes, but your kidneys aren't. Go add more cyclosporin before they shut down. Yes, Nurse Geary. That's medical officer Geary to you. So? How did it go? My mods are holding. Subject's memories are perfectly clear. If this doesn't convince Abstergo to give me a place on the Animus Project, nothing will. I oh, amazing! Who do you have in there? His name is Bayek of Siwa. The death of his son turned him into a killer. Think you'd be of interest, Abstergo? Don't start. You know, they're not gonna be happy with how you handled this assignment. They know I don't work by the book. Well, this time you lit the book on fire and then stomped on it. Anyway, none of this will matter if you're comatose. Now go get that cyclosporin. Yeah, that's interesting. So there is kind of a real life plot after all. Except uh, this woman seems to work for Abstergo. So we're not assassins this time. What? He never puts in enough snacks. Okay, so. Uh, Still looking for the cyclosporin? I definitely packed it in the med kit. Yeah, yeah. We got it. No Have rush. Two CC should do it. Don't forget the alcohol wipe. I wish I was there to help. You do a good job looking after me, even from the hotel. And I know how you like your aircon. So apparently, the animals totally fucks up your health. Also, it's ringing, but I want to look around a bit to see where are we exactly. Is there like a map? No, no menu. Damn it, my papers went everywhere. Whoops, anything important? Yeah, the notes on the animus. The genetic sequencer blueprint. Never got the creases out. <laughs> Interesting. Can I pick this up too? Here's the blueprint from my Dallas system mod. Could have used a bigger fluid chamber. Could have used a bigger piece of tape over your mouth. Whoa, so aggro. It's very funny. What about this? Can I turn it off? Generator's holding up. Good job, Layla. So yeah, for some reason she needs to be over here to interact with the animals. I guess it will be explained later, but yeah, I'm glad they did at least something this time. It's not like in the previous games where you play as literally nobody. You don't even know who you are, no voice, no nothing. Just some guy who works for Abstergo. Oh, there's another note. Oh, 
down my notes on the gene sequencing code. Are you ever gonna tell Milton that you tested it with his DNA? No, and neither are you. There's more than one way to donate your body to science. So I guess we are in the desert, pretty much in the same place. Well, that's cool. It's kind of... Oh, somebody stole my tire. Now ah, there it is. It's like a Tomb Raider a little bit, like Lara Croft. Okay, but anyway... Yeah, I can actually... What? Now nah, there's probably... Yeah, there's like a limit to where I can go. There's nothing out there. So yeah. At least we have some type of protagonist in this game, like real life protagonist. Oh, I cannot climb. Like, you know, in the previous games they actually stated that being in the animus you get like the abilities to stay there long enough, like Desmond was able to do all kinds of stuff and fights later on. I wonder what happened to this, if this will actually appear in future games. Like, at some point they might Let's see to this here. Uh, rations. Ah, cool. We have a computer. Is this the other woman who we're talking to? Male. I am obviously not gonna read all this. Who are those guys, by the way? Yeah, let's. Uh, Yeah, that's definitely more than the previous games did. Let's see what else do we have here. Ooh. Come forth by day, and I will guide you home. Who are you talking to? By ex mummy. Real chatterbox. Holy that shit! One. Holy shit! This is the guy we are playing as. So she now I understand what's happening. She like somehow connected the animus to the actual body, so it's not one of her ancestors. It's she just like. What the fuck? Okay, I mean that's um. Stone Kittred Esquire. You're fucking kidding me. Yeah, that's that's interesting. Okay, I, I guess I cannot go down there. Maybe later. Maybe we will also learn how to climb and stuff, and then. But yeah, that's cool. How now you don't need to have ancestors who are somehow important. You just connect it to a dead body. Yeah. Very interesting solution. Okay, let's see the animus is beeping let's see what it wants yeah let's go going back in this is so badass be careful yeah now it makes sense why she is in the middle of the desert Okay, let's go. protect this great land. Alexandria is where the snake thrives, and Aya lives. I must find them both. It's funny how he's talking now, about the snake. Home to my old friend Menehet. He will be in the temple. He always is. I mean, because I'm also a snake. <laughs> I'm wearing a snake outfit. Not, not, not that snake, you know, not, not the Metal Gear snake. Um, anyway, let's see, there are a lot of quests. There was one high level, like 40, 44. I think this is probably a DLC quest, because it's way too high level, so I can do this after I complete the main game. For well, now, ambush in the temple. Yeah, this is what I should do, because it's level 6. This is probably what I should do first. Like, where the hell are we, by the way? 
Aha, that's a completely new map. I have to unlock it first. Let's see. This is Alexandria. Yeah, the graphics are certainly nice. But um, as I said in my initial review, there are no really tall buildings, so climbing is not really a big part of this game, like it was in previous Assassin's Creed's. It's more about story, I guess. And the gameplay is actually really nice, they really improved it a lot. What was that? A little stuttering. Okay, let's meet those guys. Can I jump? Yeah, my camo is badass. I can jump over stuff. Ah, let's get off now. Nice place. Hey, I didn't want to hide in there. This is the guy. Well. Bayek, what good fortune! I thought it would be years before we saw you again. Hail in peace, man ahead. How is your family? <laughs> the children seem to grow larger by the minute. My wife and I have our hands full. And you? Is there any news of... None. I forget myself. There are so many things in your life best not spoken of. Forgive me. I see by your garb that you have been promoted. Ah, yes. The high priest, in his grace, made me his second. And my rank is not the only thing he has changed. You must see the temple. You will give me a tour? Of course, of course. At the moment of your pleasure. Ready to see our beautiful temple? After you, Menehet. Or is it servant of the goddess? Menehet will do for one as good as family. This is far from the sorry ruin of my last visit. Yamu now plays constant host to ceremonies showing our rustic way of life, which attract many visitors with more gold than sense. Uh, a description well suited to Alexandrians. How does this sit with your faith? I confess that my thoughts are sometimes uneasy. So now he actually took it off for the cutscene. And he also still has his beard. Didn't listen to the other guy. Oh wait, I have to find them. They're hiding from me, hello. You found me. <laughs> You're not very good at hiding. Come away from there, Naila. You're getting in the priest's way. Okay, where are the others? Are you following me? You might get lost without them. I'm supposed to use the hawk, it looks like. Yeah, one is over here somewhere. In there?
Yeah, he's in there. And the others two are... Where are the others two? There's one. And the hawk is badass, he can see through objects, kinda. The last one, is that him? Yeah. Okay. Found them all. It's funny how this game turned into hide and seek with kids all of a sudden. But honestly, I don't mind. The other one, one of those guys, he was all the way up. How do I... Okay, one of the kids get... He was somewhere up here. Yeah, there he is. How did he manage to get up here? Ah, oh, there's Terrace, never mind. Hey, what are you doing? Asina, you must come down from here. This would be a good place to watch the stars. Only the priests are permitted here. You know that. Yes, but I want to see... Hush, come down now. We can watch stars from the riverbank. Ah, not this time. But I hope to pass by and visit your mother. Can I jump down here? Wait, is this an arm? <laughs> the hell is this? Look at this. Uh. Well, take this. Why is there somebody's separated arm laying around? Sorry, stay back. Oh, wait, there's a. Okay, what the heck? And I'm standing in the fire. I'm still a bit... Is this, is this like a bug? <laughs> it's supposed to be here. Because it's a weird arm. It's it's, it's bigger than... It looks like half a human. What the heck is this? Not if it's about your father. I really have to Google this later. What the heck? Okay, so the last guy was down there. Hey, I see you. What are you doing this stinky stuff? Sheba, what in the name of the gods are you doing down there? I wanted to hide, but now I can't get back out. I'm scared. Stay calm. I will help you out of there. How exactly am I supposed to get him out? Oh, yeah, that was it. Tell Manahead that the children are safe. Yeah, let's do this. This guy has a weird name, Manahead. It's like it's like Man of War. But yeah. I bet he also has his own band or something like that. I'm still a bit confused about this arm laying around. Look at this! Fraud abounds in your market. And you claim you can do nothing? The dealings of the market are beyond me. Speak rather to the offending merchant. <laughs> Priest! You have proven as false as your mummies. What's going on here? Man ahead. Your brood is delivered safely home. Thank you, friend. Hey, what did that fool want with you? Some visitors, having purchased religious objects, are angry when our village has no more dead cats to sell them. Though not a merchant. I am often the means by which the aggrieved snuff their anger. This matter needs a firm hand. A firm hand. We know we, we can find one. A whole arm, actually. Seriously, what was the thing? By the way, I googled this stuff with this weird arm. So, yeah, there was actually not much I could find about it, but apparently it's supposed to be made out of clay. And uh, basically, back then, people used to do this and bring a body part to the temple where they have problems, like if somebody has an injury or something. Yeah, as you can see, this guy is actually doing something over there. 
So basically, so the gods know where the injury is and then they can heal it. This is what people apparently thought back then, so I guess it's supposed to be, uh, you know, historically accurate. <laughs> so yeah, it's not a bug, it's actually absolutely intended. But it looks weird, because, <laughs> like why is the arm so big? Why is it not in, you know, human size? But as you can see, this guy is actually doing something. So, so, so yeah, there are a lot of tiny, nice little details they thought of. And this is actually what makes this game kind of cool. Anyway, um, there was a quest I wanted to do. So as we saw, this Manahead guy apparently has some problems at the market where people claim the icons are not real. So we have to investigate. My spirit cannot follow my wife's. The, the field of reeds. Oh, yes. yes. oh, good for you. This looks like oh. a child made it. These cat mummies are false. Uh, so, how do I investigate oh. stuff? You fit greetings. I am. You have come to the right place, Neb. We have everything you could possibly want. What I want is to ask about false idols sold at the market. I have heard rumors of such, but there is nothing to them. Now leave if you want to avoid trouble. Oh, this guy thinks he's badass. Oh, he's threatening me. Are you threatening me, Master My Jedi? Told me she bought a it's reason it then. No, These but seriously. Are false. Wait, let's, let's talk to direct. Oh, no, it's just, it's just a show. You, so... I won't pay one drachma for this. Let's well, nothing but talk to this one. Like Tell me of the fake mummies being sold here. I have no desire to be dragged into this. Menahed sent me. Your silence is an insult to his holy office. Uh, I wish to anger neither him nor the gods. We are forced to sell items of lesser quality. Or see our stalls destroyed. Who is behind this? I can say no more now. Let us meet tonight, where the village turns to farmland. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't yet have the skill to advance time. Okay, the people are really angry. There is a skill uh, you can learn, uh, so it's not like in The Witcher also, where you can sit down and wait for time to pass. Mm, okay, there we go. This is how you change it. Yeah, you can't really select. Time, I guess it's just make it dark or make it Where bright is? again. There he is. My friend, I am glad to see you have kept our appointment. Come, sit with me and share a drink of wine. I do not have time for that. <sighs> it is a beautiful night. Let us enjoy the coolness of the air for a moment before turning to business. Merchant, I am not here to take in the air. Who is behind the traffic of false icons? Well, you see, it is no simple story. There are many involved in this terrible affair, but they would all tell you the same thing. Pity the trusting man, for he suffers great pain. Yeah, that's what I thought. And you will always find it. The path to knowledge is perilous. Boom, headshot. Oh. <laughs> this guy. You wanna fight? So now what? You wanna <laughs> you wanna talk now? Uh, a man who fights as well as you can perhaps afford to be trusting. Talk, or you will meet the same fate as your friends. That will not be necessary. Among the dunes, southeast of here, is the bandit camp where the fake mummies are made. I suppose you will go and destroy it now. Better I smash the camp than your head. I mean, I can still this is Sparta. Ah, oh, no, he's, he jumped on his own. <clears throat> I wanted to kick him down. Will the favor of the gods. As Ra lives, what a disgrace. Yes, how dare they disgrace the gods. Like blasphemy. Yeah. Was this word even invented back then? Probably not. 
Whoa. Oh, this is the camp, huh? I want to see if they are sleeping or what are they doing. Yeah, they are sleeping, there's one. Defending, there's... It's a human? No, that's not a human. Yes, okay, let's go. Let's try and kill some of them silently. Wait, Whoa. is this also an enemy? Yeah, this is also an enemy. I guess he has not seen me yet. I mean, it's not like I have to kill all of them. There's one. The others are still asleep. Very good. How do I do I have to use the this? It's totally silent, you know, totally stealthy. have such shitty range to this. Yeah, so we killed them all up there. It was not really intended, but who cares. What the heck? Now that this is done. Ah, okay, that's cool. I mean, I won't die, right? How oh, good, put it out. So, if I destroy those red things, there's like oil in them, huh? Yeah, if I knew that before, <laughs> I would have incinerated those bitches. But it's cool. Let's go back to the temple. Here you are. I... How can I use the buttons of an old friend? Tonight, we will stage a grand spectacle. Our goddess Sekhmet defends the people against Isvet's chaos. But Pamu, our champion, is nowhere to be found. The high priest will judge me responsible for his absence. I'll have a look. Sekhmet bless you. His home is near the market, but check the tavern first. It pains me to ask you for a further favor. Pamu does like a drink now and again. Hmm, so that's a new quest now, huh? Let's see. This must be Pamu. Ugh. The man stinks of beer. Yeah, this guy had a really good time, huh? Oh, he looks kind of naked to me. Okay, time to wake up. I have to carry him. <laughs> oh, thank <laughs> what you. The hell? I've been trying to get him to leave for hours. <laughs> yeah, he is totally out of commission. Okay, sure, why not? Let's do it like this. I guess he will not really be able to participate. <laughs> In the play. 
Yeah, I have the feeling I will have to take his place or something like that. This is probably... This is how games usually handle this kind of scenario. Or do I have to sober him up somehow? Uh, I don't think it's... Yeah, he does not seem to be very happy about... You know, him being dragged over here. Yeah. That is Pamu! What has happened to him? His passion for toasting Sekhmet has exceeded his head for drink. This is a disaster! People have come from the Red Land and the Black to see him fight! If a fight is all that is needed, I could replace him. Of huh. course, Magi! You honor yourself in saving me from disgrace. Speak to the High Priest in the Temple Courtyard. He will take care of the rest. Yeah. I mean, it was kind of obvious, but okay, let's take his place. So, who do we have to fight? Your Holiness, I am here to fight for Sekhmet. You're not Pamu. He was meant to play Sekhmet. Pamu is... ill. He is recovering at the temple. Fine. Follow me. Yo guys, look at this. That's King from Tekken. Ooh, I get a cool helmet. Can I keep it? Though this is a friendly bout, we must stay vigilant. Do not fear. Sekhmet will receive a fine tribute. We give thanks for your presence on this sacred night. We invite your witness on the solemnity of our customs. We unveil to you a ritual that has guarded us for century upon century. Make so every eye years, to look really. upon the warrior. For... <laughs> Should malice cling too strongly to your hearts, Isfet, the evil one, shall smite the goddess! Ah! And oh, helmet. condemn Yamu to a hundred seasons of darkness! With horns. But should your hearts be pure, the goddess shall favor us. Shielding us from the obscurity of chaos. Let the battle Sekhmet, begin. Away, oh, bad luck. Since a time unknown, Sekhmet the lioness has Kill shielded us from Isfet's greed. Isfet was once husband to Maat, goddess of all. Tampering with her scales of judgment, he grew fat on the souls of mortals. Ma'at cast him out of the Hall of Justice. In his hunger, he returned. But Sekhmet knew Sekhmet, his heart and guarded the door against him. Their battle lasted 20 days and nights before Sekhmet subdued the Lord of Chaos. The warrior of Sekhmet oh, come on. back chaos! Look, his weapon is based. Somehow I cannot charge this one. The lioness's fangs will clean Wait, the dark. Which one is Sekhmet? And which one is Sekhmet? Send the fire! Send the fire! The warrior of Sekhmet beats back chaos! Sekhmet's might enlivens your arm! Look, his weapon is based in Sekhmet's mouth! The I could swear you were the blood eater herself. Ah, oh, the priest's recounting of the battle between the goddess and Isfet was <laughs> new to me. It is a tale of his own invention. You will not hear it outside Yamu. Would that you'd agree to stay with us longer. 
But I know that greater duties call you. I'll say goodbye to the children before I leave. Do so. They'll miss you. You are always welcome in Yamu, whenever your journeys bring you to our gnome. Yeah, not bad. Keep that's, the uh... mask and staff of the goddess as oh. poor tokens of our So I do keep it, that's cool. New outfit. Yeah, that was actually kind of like a mini boss fight. It was not bad. Let's try out the outfit. Yeah, this is it. I get to kill. Well, the weapon was kind of shitty. I didn't really like it. That outfit is cool with the tiger mask. All right. So um, yeah. Let's see what else is there to do. A uh, couple of side quests more. Unfortunately, we did not make it to Alexandria quite yet. There is still a lot to do here. But let's see if we can do this in the next video. So stay tuned.